Kids Mobile Detailing was developed as a vocational program under the Fairweather Lodge model, which is a housing program for adults with mental illness. Uh, the gentlemen who live in the Fairweather Lodge got together and decided on a business that they wanted to develop, and it was the mobile detailing. So first we did in-shop um, training with Falcone Motors in Moon Township, and from that we had funding through grants to purchase the van and to set it up. So now we go out and we solicit business it's run as any normal business would be run, just under the umbrella of the 501c3 organization. Uh, well, this was set up by our own home, and it was actually 10 years in the making to establish their Fairweather Lodge out of Moon Township. There are several other Fairweather Lodges in Pittsburgh, um, mostly run through Mercy Behavioral Health and Allegheny County, so they have some. But the idea is that these men deserve a chance for employment and with some of their history and background, they haven't been able to sustain full-time employment. So what we give them is an opportunity to do valuable work um, on meeting their needs. We can, we can adjust hours, workload. We capitalize on their strengths and what they can bring to the program. The individuals involved with this program have ongoing mental illnesses, and some are in recovery. Some are, have gone through the recovery process some have actually been homeless, and that makes them eligible to live then in the lodge. And we then provide them the vocational opportunity. The Fairweather Lodge program was actually developed in the 1960s by a Dr. Fairweather because he saw that adults with serious mental illness, many times uh, the families, it's not that they had given up on them, but they'd been through a lot and it was difficult for them to find stable housing. And without stable housing, you can't have stable employment. So that model has really been around for a long time. And again, you know, our own home, it took 10 years to get the Moon Township Lodge up and running. And based on that, then once that lodge was up and running, we wanted to meet the vocational piece. Um, the men did try janitorial, that didn't work out that well. There is a limited janitorial contract, but then we thought, well, we need a stronger vocational piece. And that's how they developed the mobile detailing. So you've been doing the detailing for about a year? No, actually we started, I started with the program in April, April and we did our first training April through June at Falcone and then we had the van up and running. Well, I think everything we do is a success story. Uh, every employment opportunity that we can give these individuals, um, you know, it builds self-esteem. We all want to feel that we contribute something valuable. And, you know, we've done five details now and each one we get a little better at it, <laughs> get the process down a little closer. Um, there are two gentlemen who live at the Fairweather Lodge who are directly involved in this. We also have 15 at-large members that we've trained through Mercy Behavioral Health and Staunton Clinic. And we continue, we're going to start another training program in October and our goal is that this is self-sustaining and ongoing. Right. Well, Kid Mobile Detailing is a little unique in that we bring the product to you. A lot of people are very busy these days and they, and they don't have the time to take their car and leave it at a detail shop. So we can do residential details. Uh, we are EPA compliant. We do have a containment system that we can set up and use in areas that require that. We're also investigating the possibility of doing more commercial contracts. Uh, we're uh, trying to get up with Thermo Fisher Scientific on the south side to do details for employees while they're at work. And I think that's kind of a nice item to have. I know I would love it if I could go to work and have my guard detailed. <laughs> uh, our prices are competitive. Uh, so we are, you know, we understand the market. We've done a lot of research into it. We, our, our email address is kidmobile1 at gmail.com. And they can email us and we can send them out a price sheet. Well, we're always soliciting new trainees because our workforce, you know, not everyone is available every day, so we're always looking to build the workforce. Our long-term goal is to get a second van, so we're always looking uh, to pull individuals who would be eligible for the training program.